Hello, my dear. I'm Dr. Ala Musbah, professor of obstetrics and gynecology, faculty of medicine, Mansoura University. Today, I want to explain the MVA. This is the MVA, as you see. This is manual vacuum aspiration used in cases of uh, management of a portion, like missed abortion, before 12 weeks uh, gestational age pregnancy in case of incomplete abortion to uh, remove the uh, intrauterine content. What are the parts of MVA? As you see here, this is the cylinder. This is the cylinder. And this is the valve. We have two valves here. And this is a blunger. This one for the blender. This one. And this is the the handle of the blunder. This is the handle of the blunder. This is the blunder. And this is the shoulder where when I do withdrawal for the blunder, I hold it in this part, which is called the shoulder. Okay? Okay. And this is the adapter. The blue one means this is for cannula number six. This is cannula number six with dots, as you see. The dots is blue, like the adapter. Here, you can see the dots one centimeter interval between each other this is the aperture okay in which the content of uh, product of consumption pass through it inside the, the cannula and they are doing curettage to the uterine lining for removal of the product of consumption which pass through this cannula, this is number six. Another cannula here is number eight with white dots, as you see. It's bigger, of course, because it's eight millimeter. And as you see, the adapter is white in color. So number six, the adapter is bluish, a white, Number eight, the adapter is white in color as you see. So both of them beside each other here, you can see them. Okay, we connect the adapter in this part like this. Okay, so how it works. After the dilatation of the cervix, or if the cervix can pass this uh, six millimeter cannula, we insert it inside the uterine cavity like that. After doing negative pressure inside the cylinder, how to do negative pressure? First, close the pad. How to close the valve? Here we have by valve, another MEBA with one valve. This is this one with two valves. I close the valve like that, by compressing it like that. This is closed valve right now. Then I withdraw the plunger like that. You can see. Turn. I reach this part. Okay, I was drawing the plunger. I reached the shoulder. It is fixed here on the shoulder. This is the arms of the plunger. Hold it on the shoulder. Now there is negative pressure inside the cylinder. Then introduce it inside the drain cavity. After you pass the internal os, pass inside the drain cavity. You should release 
the valve like that. I release the valve, then suction and the product of conception will pass through the aperture in the cannula down here till reaching the cylinder. Okay, this is how to do manual vacuum aspiration for miss the portion or complete the portion. Also, you can use it for taking an endometrial sample. This is the end of the story. Lastly, I want you to remember that we have different sizes, six millimeter like this one, eight millimeter like this one, and there is 10 and the 12 millimeter also, if the size of the uterus is bigger than eight weeks. And as I said, we use it if gestation age is less than 12 weeks. Thank you. I'm Dr. Aram Usbah, Professor of Obstetrics and Gynecology, Faculty of Medicine, Mansoura University.